Hey, what's happening, buddy? This is Hayden Adams with A Designer Who Codes. In today's video, I wanna talk about how we can bring in the embed code from Apple using their Apple podcast embed code and make it responsive in our HTML website using Bootstrap. I've got an example right here, and if I adjust my browser, when I hit the mobile framework, it then defaults to a mobile responsive design within the frame. So I'm gonna show you how you can bring in the code, bring in Bootstrap, and make it responsive. And with that, let's get started. All right, once again, my name is Hayden Adams with A Designer Who Codes, and this channel is all about helping you design more and to troubleshoot less. If that's what you're looking for online, then hit that subscribe button, hit that little notification bell so you never miss a video. All right, so the first thing we have to do is bring in Bootstrap. I'm at getbootstrap.com, and I'm gonna to head to Get Started. Here is where I can download a boilerplate template in which to use this with. I'm gonna scroll down until I find the starter template, just because this is a great tool to use, so I can show you how to embed your code from the very beginning. I'm gonna copy and paste, or actually I'm just gonna click on the copy right here. I'm gonna to come to a blank HTML document and paste in the information. If I save it, head over to Chrome, refresh my page, hello world. And just so you can see it is working, I can type in the words, this is a test. And we can see it's working if I command R to refresh. Awesome, I have an HTML document, but what I first wanna do is make it responsive. Because everything came in with Bootstrap, I'm gonna bring in the container, and the container is where everything works and breaks into responsive design. I'm gonna type in div, class equals container and bring back this should now be responsive and if i save it refresh awesome this should now be responsive perfect it now breaks and breaks and breaks now that we have a responsive design, let's go over to Apple and copy the embed code so it now can work inside the responsive design. I have a, web, I have a website. I've got a podcast right here from some of my friends, PS, the Paprika Southern Podcast. And here's where I can actually come in to embed the actual code. If I click on this share icon, you get four little icons. You have the link, Facebook, Twitter, and now you actually get embed code. So if I copy that, it says embed code copied. Now where I have this should be responsive, if I drop it down, iframe, now if I save this, like magic, it just appears on the screen. Pretty cool, Apple makes this really impressive to use. And now if I adjust the browser, now you'll see how it becomes responsive in my site. If you want more videos helping you design more and troubleshoot less, check out the videos I have here and don't forget to subscribe. As always, I'm Hayden Adams with A Designer Who Codes. Thanks so much for watching and have a fantastic day.